Yeah, I think we're a good camera. So, okay. So, this bad boy would be the best budget wireless gaming headphones in the market for 2022, in my opinion, and you might not have heard of it. So what's going on guys? Welcome to our video and this is your host, your one only Giver, and welcome to another tech cool episode. Now today we're going to take a look at Lenovo Legion's H600 wireless gaming headset. Now this is part of their Lenovo Legion gaming brand. If you have heard the Lenovo Legion laptop, monitor and stuff, yeah, they are part of that big circuit. Okay, so let's dive in with the specification of this product. Now it has a 2.4 GHz lossless connection. Yes, I'm reading outside the box. It has a dynamic 50mm sound drivers and it has a flip to mute microphone which I really love the idea of using. So if you are the type of person that doesn't want to push buttons in your Zoom meetings or in your Discord or in the headphones, you just need to flip it down for you to talk and flip it up if you don't want to use it. So yeah, it's pretty convenient and also if you can see, it's not an annoying type of placement of the microphone compared to other microphones or gaming headset that has a, a flippable microphone on this price range or yeah. Next would be a 20-hour battery life in full charge and a breathable memory foam cushion for your left and right ear and the top of your head. Also, it has a volume wheel instead of volume buttons, which I really love. And you can charge it by two ways, by using a USB Type-C, thank God, and by using their other product, the S600 Gaming Station um, headset stand, wherein you just need to place it, and it's just gonna charge it by itself. But of course, it's gonna cost you to add that, but we're going to talk about that later. Also, we have the basic 3.5mm jack port in case you don't want to do wireless headphone gaming. Now, let's talk about the things that I didn't like about this product first before we go to the good stuff. The LED indicators for charging is only red and green, so you're really not sure if your headphone is already full charge or not. Yeah, next is it's a little bit stiff when you wear it because it doesn't swivel a little bit, it just turns. Uh, for me, it's not a deal breaker because you can just adjust it and of course, it's gonna go loose over time when you start using it more. I have only used this product for like five days and still stiff, which is a good thing meaning that this headphone is sturdy. Also, there's a little bit of hard plastic on the top because this is what you use um, together with the gaming station. So if it doesn't bother you, which doesn't bother me, then this headphone is... Yeah. Okay, now before we proceed to the good stuff, uh, make sure that you are subscribed to the channel and punch the notification bell icon as many times as you can in the so you'll be notified every time that I'm going to release a video. Also, my giveaway ends today, so that's my 3,000 subscriber giveaway. So we'll be drawing the winners in the next few days or weeks. Don't worry, there might be a delay, but I haven't really forgotten about the giveaway and you're still going to get your prize in case you win. Now with that out of the way, let's proceed to the good stuff, which is the actual performance of this headphone when watching movie, music, or even, of course, playing games. So let's start first with the movies or music or music videos or just same. Now for the loudness of this headphone, I'm going to rate it at 5 because it's really loud. Like in case there are some videos or movies that is really, you know, low in volume, you can crank that volume wheel up and it's gonna give you the loudness that you need. For the quality, still 5. It's clear and you know the clarity is also good now for the bass i'm going to rate it 4 which is a little bit higher compared to the rest of other headphones that i've reviewed in this channel also there's no tweaking on this product because as by default it's already good now for games of course most of most of you guys that are watching this are gamers but first let's go with the fps or first person shooting type of games so i've tested it using rainbow six siege Valorant and Call of Duty. So the loudness which is a really factor when playing this type of FPS games is rated at 5 meaning that you're going to hear the footsteps. It has the same loudness that I have with Arctis 1 or even louder by a bit. So yeah, the quality it's good. It doesn't sound like a tin can when you try to shoot some objects so we are good at that. Also it has a vertical sound. For most of you guys that doesn't know what vertical sound means, it means that if your opponent is upstairs and there's like a ceiling between the two of you, you can clearly hear their footsteps. Now with that being said, let's proceed to the final one would be the RPG or casual type of games. For this one, it's like flat out 5. I'm not going to explain anymore, it's flat out 5. Both loudness and quality, 5. 
Like, yeah. Now, do you know why I have mentioned that this probably is the best budget wireless gaming now in the market? Because of those ratings that I just gave to you. So, <laughs> I don't know what to say. That's pretty much it. And of course, I haven't forgotten about the microphone test. So, the settings of the test that I did will be down on your screen. So, enjoy! So, mic test. This is the sound quality of the microphone of each 600 wireless gaming headset from Lenovo Legion. Mic test. One, two, three. So, what do you guys think? Would you be buying this? Yes. Would you be like parting with your old headphones? Yes. Because this one is like a godsend to us gamers and content creators because it is really good. And considering the price that I got this, it's really cheap. It's on the budget side. But of course, that's on sale. But this product goes on sale every time. And considering the original price point, it's still on the budget category if you're going to compare to the other gaming brands like Razer, Logitech, etc. So, yeah. Huh. Yeah, is it a short or long video? But I think, yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, yeah. H600, get it. This is the first headphone, I think first, for this year that I will really urge you guys to buy because there's no freaking downside on this bad boy. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you do, press thumbs up and consider subscribing for more videos like this. And don't worry, there will be a video of this one and the H. I'm going to give you a preview. H600 gaming station. So watch out. So yeah, this guy signing off. Bye bye.